flow. I don't think we see a ton out of this, but it's over the weekend and into next week. This is where the forecast changes a huge shift in our pattern. High pressure will split one region moving to the southeast US, the other over the Baja Peninsula. And this gap represents a weakness in the atmosphere, opening up an avenue for tons of tropical moisture in Central America to work northward and toward Texas into next week. This is the moisture we're talking about now. And here's the front we were just mentioning. This front will sit in the northern Gulf and deflect a lot of the moisture toward southern Florida this week. Our chance for this moisture to move farther west will be locked in with this high pressure moving into the eastern Gulf over the weekend. As that high gets closer and into the southeastern US, it's going to push a lot of this moisture right toward Texas. So by Monday, Tuesday, we're looking at that deep and rich moisture moving into the Texas Gulf Coast. Some guidance wanting to throw out some broad spin in the Bay of Campeche or the southwestern Gulf. Not really concerned about that right now, but we are watching it. The Hurricane Center is not flagging this area at this point, but something to watch there. And if there was broad spin, it would further amplify moisture moving in to our region. So next week looks like a big shift in our pattern right now. We'll be updating that all